Hi, this is my part two to Anno 1800, how to make money. I will be going full into depth on some easy ways to make money. And we're starting right now. Step one of my tips is goods. Now, goods, as you can see, the market doesn't give any money, but the market allows goods to be sold. As you can see here, the fish need gives free coins. I'm guessing per worker. I, I actually don't know whether it's per house or worker. It's even one of those two. Now the work clothes give a seven plus, and as sausages give a five plus. And then if you go deeper into it, the needs like bread give a five plus also. With as I haven't got the soap yet, so it doesn't tell me, but I expect they give money. And if you go into happiness, the pub actually gives money. The um, church incre increases happiness, doesn't actually give money, but Skinaps, which is needed on this island, gives money. It gives a total of seven plus money. And that is a big boost. And as you can see in here, I'm almost out of the brow red because I've placed more houses from my previous video. So now, if we build a potato farm. Okay, so we got our potato farm. We will now start producing potatoes, which is the required need for skin to snap. Actually, we need more fuels. So let's just get some more fuels. Alright, we now have enough fields. So now we can start producing a whole lot of potatoes. Now, in order to make the snaps, you also need a snaps distillery. So we are going to build one. Which we are going to build right here. Now, you can build industrial and residential areas, but I've just got this set out for the simplicity of the video. This isn't a serious playing the game. It's just to show you how you can make a money. Fire. Okay, we now have a skin app going to the storage house. Once it's put off at the storage, we should start getting money from it. And as you can see, it's making more. Now, luxury needs give a huge boost to money income. And remember, Try to also increase your houses into workers because they give way much more money. But as said in my previous video, you do not want to go below the job section for whatever class of workers you are doing. Okay, step two of how to make money is quests. Now I'm going to show you how you do a quest. Basically, what you do is you go like here, Dream of wide you get your crest, see 4,116. Now we've got the crest, now we need to deliver six tons of bread. Okay, so the final bread for the crest is being delivered, as you can see. It is just unloading in the storage. So now we can get our 60 units of bread. Flagship at your service. Flagship ready for orders. There you go in the good section. Now there's another unit of bread. I don't think it's loaded. If it has loaded. Uh, looks like it used the bread. So we just gotta wait a bit. It's not gonna take long as producing another piece of bread. Okay, so. Final piece of bread for real this time. Attention for the admiral. We've got we have five bread, we need one more piece of bread. And then we're good to do this. Game saved. Well, I see. Flagship ready for orders. 
Alright, so once you've got your item that you need for the quest, service. this is a deliver quest. There are several different types of quests. I've seen like retrieval quests, Brother. take a picture quests, and of course delivery quests. They're the only three I've seen. I don't know if there's more. There probably is, I guess. However, the quests are timed. On our way. So you need to go to the target place. As this ship here is the target place. And as said, you can see we are now in the green with money. We have like 190 plus income. So we're doing all right with following these tips, even for a really bad island. And it's also badly laid out. It really needs fixing laying out. Alright, so we are almost at our target place. My ship is just coming straight in. Ooh, for me. And then you'll get a message saying that are you ready to hand in your quest? You click the green tick. The happiest and possible boom, thing. That is how you do quests. Which is pretty easy. Attention, Which brings Admiral. me into my next point. Alright, the third thing is... Now you may not have known that this game is about managing resources. Once you're in the green, you basically are good to, for example, build a second lumberjack house. Because you have enough money income to build a second lumberjack As I said, you shouldn't overproduce at the start of the game. But once you're in the green, start building resources that you can take advantage of also. As said, it will increase your production, let you build faster if you're building lumberjack houses and sawmills. Remember, manage the balance with your resources. Don't build crazy. Last bit of tip is when the editor tells you about the latest edition of the newspaper, Meet you can go into it humbling. If there is and there will be a list anything, really. of Imagine it, and we can do it. articles. So you want, there will be a list of articles. So you want to click on edit as you can see, you there are some house. Quite little buffs. One that gives no effect. Uh, uh, I, I, I don't know why you would want that one unless I guess you want to get rid of something. I'm certain they won't read between the lines. But you can drag articles no over problem. other articles. Our typesetter will be As you can see, that one gives happiness. But there is one that is very special as tip, which gives a bonus to income. You drag it over the article. You're always uniquely diplomatic. If I publish this newspaper article, I will have a 5% plus to income. Now that may not seem like a lot, but if you keep spending influence, which is what it costs to edit a newspaper, eventually you can get Game that saved. stack of income. Now, see, I will publish it, which will cost 55 income. And now, yes. if you go to my bar send it out. of balances, I have a 47 plus consumeration tax. And that has brought me to 320 income plus income, and it is on the rise. It is on the rise. Okay, if you liked this video, Give it a like and subscribe, it helps me out, and also I just want to say I made a part 2 to this video because I didn't go full in depth in what I said in the last video and I wanted to explain some more because I don't think I explained it properly. Anyway, I hope this new bits of tips helps you and I hope that you can grow your trade empire in NO 1800 to have lots of money like mine, 323 plus. Anyway, this is Demi Jack signing out.